Shashi Tharoor discharged in the Sunanda case. Shashi Tharoor, who is currently on bail in this case, was charged cheated by the Delhi police for abatement to suicide. Pushkar was found dead in a suite of a luxury hotel in Delhi on the night of January 17, 2014. Since then, the Congress MP Shashi Tharoor, uh, the husband of Sunanda Pushkar, has been the main accused in the matter, according to the Delhi police. And now, Shashi Tharoor has been discharged. Here's some big news coming in. Shashi Tharoor has now been discharged in Sunanda Pushkar's case. Uh, he was, in fact, on bail in the case. He was charged cheated by the Delhi police for abatement to suicide. Pushkar was found dead. Sunanda Pushkar was found dead in a luxury hotel uh, in her suite in Delhi on the night of 17th January 2014. The Congress MP Shashi Tharoor, uh, who was the husband of Sunanda, has been the main accused in this matter, according to the Delhi police. But now there's some relief for Shashi Tharoor. After years of, uh, in fact, complying with the legal system here, going back and forth uh, with the police, he was on bail. And here is Shashi Tharoor now finally discharged. Nalini Sharma for more on that. Nalini, some relief for Shashi Tharoor. Take us through what exactly the order says. Well, Nabila, not just some relief, it's a massive relief coming in for Shashi Tharoor because the court was one step away from the trial in the entire case beginning and it was put up for framing of charges today. And in case the charges had been framed against Shashi Tharoor, then the trial would have begun on this Ananda Pushkar murder case, a uh, death case, I beg your pardon. But at the same time, it's been clarified by the court that the loan accused who was Shashi Tharoor has been discharged which, mean, which means that there has been no merit that has been that has been found in the charge sheet that, has been, that was filed by the Delhi police so no trial will go on against Shashi Tharoor in this entire case right now uh, the Rouse Avenue court is providing a massive massive relief to him which essentially means that the theory that was put forth regarding the drug overdose to beat the cause of death because of uh, for Sunanda Pushkar is a theory that will have to be accepted right now since the loan accused in the case has now been discharged by the Rouse Avenue Court. So it's a big breaking news coming in. It's a massive relief for Shashi Tharoor along with a massive setback for the Delhi police that had built a case on Section 498A over the course of the past several years before the Rouse Avenue Court while naming Shashi Tharoor as the only accused in the charge sheet that was filed by them. But now Shashi Tharoor has been discharged by the Rouse Avenue Court, which means there will be no trial against him in the case. The charges have not been framed against him because there was no merit that was found in the Delhi police charge sheet that had been filed before the court. Nalli, uh, while we do know that it is big relief now for Shashi Tharoor, he has finally been discharged in the case. Any clarity on the reason behind Sunanda Pushkar's death? Well, there were parallel theories that were put forth before the court during the course of the arguments along with the arguments that were happening on the charge sheet as well where it was put forth by the prosecution that the cause of death uh, might have been tampered with because there was communication that was made with the uh, uh, head of department at AIMS where Shashi Tharoor had approached him and asked him for a specifically a natural death certificate for Sunanda Pushkar. So there were several red flags that were raised by the prosecution during the course of arguments before the Rouse Avenue Court. But at the same time, the order today is significant. Why? Because after a long wait, the court has finally pronounced this order. There were several adjournments that were being given in this case. Almost the last four times, if I'm not wrong, this order was getting adjourned and the court was not giving its final judgment. But the final judgment has finally come through today where they've said that Shashi Tharoor has been discharged because no merit has been found in the charges that were leveled against him for abetment to suicide as well as 498A that were ca categorically mentioned by the prosecution during the course of arguments. So Shashi Tharoor no doubt will be heaving a sigh of relief today because this has been a case that he has, like you correctly pointed out, been embroiled in the legal proceedings for several years now, ever since 2014 when this incident occurred. But at the same time, the charge sheet from the Delhi police we saw several years later that was filed only, I think, about two years back before the Rouse Avenue court, after which ever since char uh, arguments on this charge sheet were going on. But right. today, Shashi Tharoor has officially been discharged, which means that there will officially be no trial against him in the case and he will no more have to face the prosecution for Sunanda Pushkar's death. Nalini Sharma, thank you very much for joining us with those details.